you guys a little bit of an update on my uh, hydroponics greenhouse. Some stuff's really doing well. And before I get started on that, if you enjoy this video, go ahead and click that subscribe button. Click the little bell so you'll get uh, notified whenever I make videos. And uh, you know, I make these videos for fun, but it's nice to know that you guys enjoy them. And I, I appreciate the comments and everything. So let's get started. This is my garden salsa pepper. I'm not sure what that really is, what variety it really is, but I already harvested a couple of these. Um, in my last video, I made chili and I showed making that. These are growing really well. It's a habanero. It's turning into a bush. This thing's just growing great. It hasn't set fruit yet. Every uh, bud kind of dies off, but I'm sure it's going to set some soon. It's I just can't believe how full that pepper plant is. And then I've got my three bell peppers that are producing like crazy. Doing really well. I swear every day these peppers are doubling in size. The actual peppers, not the plants. The plants are getting big too. So you take a step back. They're getting pretty big. Probably the uh, the main attraction here is my cantaloupe, which is not something I see done hydroponically very often. But it is setting cantaloupe fruit really, really well. So I'm not sure what I'm going to do yet. I, I originally intended on uh, building some sort of trellis for these things to vine up on. But now I'm thinking I might just let them grow like onto the ground or maybe along this, this pipe here or something. I don't know. And I'm not going to put a lot of effort into it, whatever it is. Just going to kind of let them do their thing. But there's a lot of cantaloupes on here. It's not just, you know, that one. There's another one there. There's tons of little ones all over the place. So we'll see how they do. Keep you guys up to date on it. Here's some more habanero peppers. These ones I grew from seed. And when I put these in here, these were basically dead. I started them way too soon. And I ran out of room to be growing them. I was growing uh, tomatoes and peppers in my microgreens grow room. And I st like I said, I started them too soon and then I wasn't taking very good care of them. So these were essentially dead when I put them in here. And they've really come back now. They're, they're starting to really look nice. Same thing with these. And if you've seen my previous videos on, on this, uh, this greenhouse, you'll see that these look terrible when I put them in. But so these, I'm pretty sure that these are jalapeno. And uh, there's four plants in there, or maybe even five or so. But they haven't really set fruit yet, but well, actually it is. You can see there's a little ha uh, jalapeno right there. And this little bush here is gonna provide a ton of jalapenos. These are more of the ones that were brought back from the dead. And I don't know exactly what these are, but I think they are a chocolate bell. Because I, I know I planted some uh, chocolate bell peppers, which I've never planted before. And I think that's what those are. But once again, if you, were to, if you saw these when I put them in, you wouldn't think there was any chance they were going to actually turn into anything. And they're doing great now. So this has been a short video, just wanted to keep you guys up to date. I showed this stuff the day I put it in, and so I thought it was right just to keep, you know, making videos of the updates and show you guys how it goes. Thanks for watching, really appreciate you guys.